hello everyone in this video, we are going to see uh, how to use Adobe Firefly Generative Fill. Uh, with this latest tool from Adobe Firefly, you can create stunning images without Photoshop. We can also edit images in a professional way with simple prompts and clicks. We can now edit images directly on the website, so no need to install any softwares. Please check our article uh, to know more about the Adobe Firefly generative fill tips and tricks. We have added the link in the description. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Press the bell icon so that you can receive notifications about our videos instantly. Now, let us get into the video. Uh, to use this amazing tool, first, you have to visit the official Adobe Firefly website. Please log in with your email address or you can continue with your Google account. Uh, Adobe Firefly has a bunch of tools, text to image generative fill, uh, text effect and generative recolor. Uh, they are all free to use and available online. There's some tools that are listed but not yet available to use. We can see a lot of images in the gallery that are generated using AI. Uh, we can use those images to test the features in this video. Okay, now let's dive into the generative fill tool. Um, upload the image that we want to edit by clicking the upload image button. You can drag and drop the position of the image by clicking the pan option. Uh, here we're using an image from the Adobe Firefly gallery, which contains the Adobe watermark. Uh, now let us remove the watermark from the image. Uh, pick the remove tool and select the area to remove and click remove. Now you can see the watermark being removed and it is filled perfectly. It will provide you with a list of images to choose from. We can select the image we need to use and click the key button to download the image. Now let us add more objects to the image. Uh, we can control the brush size in the brush settings and click the insert tool and select the area you want to insert the object, enter your prompt and click generate with the appropriate prompt, you can add anything to the image with this option. Here we are gonna add the moon to this image. Uh, we can select the area where we need to add the moon and enter the prompt. You can see a variety of images. Choose the right one that fits your needs. Click the keep button and download it. Um, now let's try to remove the background and Change the overcoat in this image. Uh, upload the image and select the dress that we need to change. If you need to simply change it, just click generate. We don't have to provide any prompt. If you need something specific, you can provide a prompt. It really works awesome. You should try this yourself. Now let's replace the background with a beach or with some natural look. Uh, click background, enter the prompt, and click generate. Wow, the image looks amazing. See how perfect this works. Really impressive. So guys, here are some pro tips. If you work with a pencil sketch, the changes applied will be also in pencil sketch. If you work with a anime image, it will apply anime objects. Overall, the output looks extraordinary. Uh, it will add objects which match the size of your selection. If you need to add a ball, make a round selection, or you need to add a box, make a rectangle selection. We hope you found this video helpful. Um, you can try it yourself and leave us comments. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more content like this. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.